Have you noticed as you're starting to get a little older, it's a little harder to get down on the ground or even harder yet to get back up off the ground? Well, sometimes it's an issue of mobility, not just lack of strength. And as we get older, we lose the mobility in our hip joints, the ability of those um, ball and socket um, bones to move within the hip joint. So I have a couple of quick things to show you today that can help your hip mobility and you do not have to go to a gym to do them. And if you have a firm enough bed, you can probably do them on your bed as well. There's lots of ways to get your hips more mobile, but I like these because they don't require any balance. All you need to do is have a, a firm support on the ground or on your bed in order to do these moves. So here we go. First one is lie on your back and bring one knee up into your chest and hold while you flatten that other leg out on the ground or the surface. Then what I want you to do is grab onto the shin area and allow your thigh or your upper leg to drop to the side. Just pain-free range of motion, you're always supporting. You could also grab from underneath. We're just letting the muscles relax in order to let that joint range of motion get where it can go carefully and slowly. And then what we do is we bring that foot to the outside of the opposite leg, opposite leg is still down, and we gently pull across. Moving right in through here, trying to loosen this up just a little bit and hold for about a minute. Then what we wanna do is roll up into a seated position. We're gonna put our hands back behind us. We wanna split the knees just a little bit or the legs and drop side to side. Pain-free range of motion. So if you can only go to here, that's what you do and you rock back and forth. If you can drop those knees to the ground, drop them to the ground. Again, pain-free range of motion. Try for five or 10 repetitions. Now this took me less than two, two and a half minutes to show you. You can do this at home. It will take you less than two or three minutes to do. And I guarantee you, if you do this consistently for a few weeks, your hips will feel more mobile. You'll be able to get down on the ground a little bit more comfortably and you're gonna feel great. So give these hip mobility exercises a try and we'll see you next time.